Once my character layer has been created, I'm going to export it using my swatches library that I created under Capture. I import it into my swatches. Now then, what is interesting is that the colors are smart. So, if I want to change them quickly, I just double click, I change my color, and the color is modified everywhere I use it on the file. Once I've finished with the swatches, I'm going to move on to creating the illustration, often making simple shapes, circles, supported by dynamic angles using the pen. Along with the Shape Designer tool, this Annabelle shapes to be created very quickly, so I can get the illustration that I want. So, once I've created my character with all my simple shapes, I create a razor simple pattern which I also put in my swatches. And to apply the pattern to the kimono, I'm going to use the appearance palette, which I really use quite often. Then I duplicate the background and I add my pattern to its new background layer. And what's interesting here is that I'm going to be able to change the blending mode and the opacity, all while keeping a simple path. And there you have it.